you're starting to feel the chill in the air, then it's time to make this delicious orange cake that is made with olive oil and it's great with a hot cup of Let me show you the ingredients. I have dry ingredients right here and wet ingredients right there. So for the dry ingredients, I have two cups of all-purpose flour, which I'm gonna add to it uh, half a teaspoon of baking soda, one and a half teaspoons of baking powder, half a teaspoon of salt. Just mix really thoroughly uh, well, and this is ready. Now, for the wet ingredients, we have two eggs. We will beat with three quarters of a cup of sugar and half a cup of olive oil. Uh, to that, I will add a cup of Greek uh, style yogurt and the king ingredient of the cake itself, it's uh, oranges. So I'm gonna zest two of those oranges and I'm gonna juice uh, some of it to add into the cake. Let's get started. Third cup of orange juice, fresh orange juice. So I grated the oranges, I uh, juiced them. I prepared my pan, it's uh, eight and a half by uh, four and a half uh, log pan. I oiled it with some olive oil and floured it so the uh, uh, cake doesn't stick. And I also have uh, my bowl ready. Uh, into this, I will add the two eggs, one, two large eggs, the sugar, three quarters of a cup. I will start beating. I, the camera stopped working for some reason. I added the olive oil into the egg and sugar mixture that I have beaten. And then I added the uh, Greek yogurt. The zest is already in there as well. Now I will be adding the mix of uh, dry ingredients, which is the flour with the baking soda, baking powder, and salt. And uh, I will also incorporate the third of a cup of fresh orange juice into the mix. Mix it slowly so you don't get uh, flour all over. Just get the flour wet so you don't have, uh, so you don't make a mess. And as I'm uh, mixing it, because I'm not gonna over mix, I don't want it to get uh, uh, gummy. It's okay if it stays a little lumpy, that's no big deal. I will be adding also the orange juice. This loaf is packed with nutrients, as you see, protein from Greek yogurt, antioxidants from olive oil, and vitamin C from orange juice. Relatively, is low in sugar as well. Just incorporate everything, and uh, my pan is ready to pour that uh, batter into it, and it's gonna uh, go into a 350 degree preheated oven. Uh, for about 45 to 50 minutes until a toothpick comes out clear. We will pop into a preheated 360 degree oven for 45 to 50 minutes. And if it does get brown, too brown, just uh, tent it with a foil and let it continue to cook until the toothpick comes out clean. You should smell the aromas in my kitchen. Here's the cake. It have uh, baked and uh, it took about
about uh, 50 minutes uh, in 350 degree oven. I will wait five minutes and then I'm gonna uh, place it on a plate and I will um, top it with a little bit um, orange marmalade, uh, uh, Seville orange marmalade, which is a little bit tangy as well. It's gonna be delicious. And wait until it cools down and uh, uh, cut a piece and, and enjoy with your uh, great cup of tea. The orange cake has cooled and now I uh, topped it with a little bit of uh, Seville orange marmalade. I will dust it with uh, a little bit of uh, powdered sugar and all done, ready to be consumed. Thank you.